Six over the Brevard County coast this afternoon. Looking good out there. The Falcon 9 rocket booster that helped deliver astronauts Doug Hurley and Bob Bankin to the International Space Station arrived back at Port Canaveral today. For many, Saturday's launch brings back business and life to the Space Coast. And the rocket coming home brings a whole lot of pride. News 6's Eric Von Anken has this story all new at 5. People have been taking pictures all afternoon of that ever since the moment it steamed back into port here at Port Canaveral earlier this afternoon because it is now a piece of Space Coast history. It's the booster that took us back into space. Come back and let me know if you see it coming in. Okay, that's good. I'll see if it's on Facebook. Fumbling on her phone. Would they already be out there? Karen McNelly doesn't want to miss this. All right, this is history and I'm going to be sure to get here and get to see it. The rocket that made history over the weekend, taking American astronauts back into space from the Space Coast for the first time ever on a commercially made capsule, was coming home. My husband helped build this rocket and get America back. What does that feel like? It feels incredible. Carol, I don't think it's coming in yet. Karen McNelly hasn't missed a rocket coming home yet after they land out in the Atlantic on SpaceX's drone ship and are towed back into port. And she doesn't miss the time on the Space Coast before the Falcon 9, when the space shuttle stopped flying in 2011. People went out of business, people lost their jobs, they lost their homes, because they didn't have them open anymore for them. It was hard on them. Now Elon Musk came over, and that he has really done a fantastic job. Very much appreciate the, the support of the Space Coast. And the because of SpaceX and a fast-growing commercial space industry, the Space Coast will never again lose its place as a leader in space flight, NASA's administrator firmly believes. And for all of these people, welcoming home this history-making rocket represents bringing space flight back home to the Space Coast. So now SpaceX will spend the next few days lifting the rocket off the barge, transporting it back to the Kennedy Space Center, and then refurbishing it, fixing it up so it could fly again one day. At Port Canaveral, Eric Von Eichen getting results through six.